Welcome to GLMT Auto. Well, we've got my brother-in-law's Golf R. The water pump thermostat's gone, so I'll be doing that today. And because uh, that will be a boring video, I told him to buy Resolute. So we're fitting that and uh, doing a before and after. To be fair, there won't be a lot of talking in this because there'll be a lot of swearing. So we'll just leave the video recording, do a bit of time lapse of doing the water pump. It's going to take us seven hours to do, and then we'll do the fun bit. Right, see you in a bit. Let's go. Yeah. I'm like an addict, do I gotta have it? I ain't even playing, got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta grab it. Fuse like a magnet, lose won't have it till I'm doomed in a casket. I ain't playing, got a weird mind. Right, so we have managed to get the intake manifold off. This is probably one of the more trickier jobs you can do on this car. So, intake manifold out, and we've got to get access to this, which is the water pump and thermostat. So that's the next step. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back better than last year. It's a new me, never gonna look back. You're never gonna look back. Cause damn, I was built to last. You move so whilst we're here, we're just gonna um, remove the carbon build up on the in like intake flaps. Cause you may as well while they're out. Today, I will never be the same. Cause that's what it takes. That's it, we're almost done. So we've got intake back on, throttle body back on, new water pump, new thermostat, and we're just gonna see if we can do the uh, the fake R600 mod. Is it R600? Yeah. Yeah, R600 mod where you just drill out this, get a bit of it, bit more air intake into the, um, into the car. So this sits on here and the blank bit's here. So it just allows a bit more airflow in there. Yeah, you can get a bit of rain water in there and things like that, but it's unlikely. And Tom only drives this when it's, um, it's a, it's a driveway princess car, isn't it, Tom? Yeah. But um, yeah, we'll get all back together and give it a start up, bleed the coolant, and then we'll get straight on to the center res. So good news is she's fired up. There's no leaks at all. We're just waiting for the uh, corn to bleed through. So we've manually bled it. And now we're just going to let it run, get out of temperature and then bleed. So fingers crossed, we can now do the exhaust and we can do the center res delete. Yeah. Um, and that paired with the R600 mod, we can uh, we get a bit more noise and a bit more power. Golf's up in the air. Now we've got to crack these two knocked off slice this around about here and that takes this res out and then we've got a nice shiny new pipe to put in so we'll get cracking playing, got a weird mind if you work eight hours i'm gonna work nine if the shoot tastes sour you should taste mine i'm gonna stay in power for a long time get up now nah, i ain't a quitter toss me the ball i'm a really big hitter big picture i'm a straight killer Rise in the song to the highest bidder got juice got gas i'm a move fast new shoes new tracks like who's that i'm new come back better than last year so no me never gonna look back you never gonna look back cause damn i was built to last you move slow when i move fast and that's facts only i can make a change slowly take a step today i will never be the same cause that's what it takes when the is off you want to go on but of course you've got to start out with no silences on haven't you <laughs> Never gonna look back Cause damn I was built to last You move slow 
when I move fast And that's facts Only I can make a change Slowly take a step today I will never be the As you can see, Tom's just driven off a happy man, saved himself a thousand pounds, sent a res on, so the exhaust sounds wicked. The video probably doesn't do it justice, but so much better. No water leaking from the water pump thermostat, and he's just done a drive-by um, with the biggest smile on his face. He's not had the car for three months, so it made his day. We've got a couple more videos to come out, so keep your eyes peeled for them. We'll keep you updated on Instagram and on YouTube, of course. Like and subscribe if you like this sort of content, working on cars, messing around with cars, basically anything to do with cars. And uh, here's the next time.